258 days. That's how long the college basketball world has been on hold. Uh, the 2020 NCAA tournament has been canceled. That's how long fans have been waiting to hear the familiar sounds of the sneakers on the court, the dribble of the ball, the swish of the net. America has been patiently waiting, and today, the wait is over. In Annapolis, the United States Naval Academy hosts the seventh annual Veterans Classic. We've got basketball coming up from the Naval Academy. Navy returns four of last year's starters. Nice pass and a cut and finish from Greg Summers. To face off against George Washington sophomore stars Jamison Battle and Jameer Nelson Jr. Stuck from Nelson Jr. on the run out. College basketball is back. George Washington. Got it. Navy. There you go. That's big. Veterans Classic next on CBS Sports Network. The Veterans Classic from gorgeous Annapolis, the sailing capital of the world. And in Alumni Hall, the Navy midshipmen host the George Washington Colonials. Good afternoon, everybody. John Sadak alongside the New York City Basketball Hall of Famer and Pete Gillen. College Hoops has finally returned, and what better way to tip it off than with a salute and a thank you to the men and women in service. No question. Veterans Day was scheduled this year for November 11th on a Wednesday. I think every day should be Veterans Day, John. We show respect, admiration, gratitude, and love for the men and women who served our country. They protected us so we can do all the things that we love to do, like broadcast a college basketball game. And the man who serves Navy, Cam Davis, their all-everything electric guard. Cam Davis is the leader of the Navy team, both on and off the basketball court. Leading scorer last year with 16 points a game. He can score all different levels. He led the team in assists and three-pointers made. He can take over a game at any time. He's a special player. On the other side, GW blessed with one of the great shooting trios in all of college hoops. The late, great Chuck Daly said, Shooting makes up for a multitude of sins. And GW has three tremendous shooters uh, that made all over 80 baskets a game. Tremendous players, Battle, Jack, and Seymour. When they get going, they're really tough to beat. And we will get going with our ceremonies. We go to public address announcer Greg Davis. Ladies and gentlemen, at this time, we ask that you please rise for the singing of the national anthem by midshipman second class Andre Rasco. Oh, say can you see by the dawn's early light what so proudly we hailed at the twilight's last gleaming whose broad stripes and bright stars through the perilous fight. O'er the ramparts we watched were so gallantly streaming, and the rocket's red glare Bursting in air gave proof through the night that our flag was still there. Oh, say, does that star spangled banner yet To those who serve, we thank you. Up next, two young teams will lift the curtain on the college basketball campaign. Just wait and see. 